get this show on the road. It's the rundown. City 1051 FM. My name is Beanbo. I've got Young Alpha in the building. I've got Kevin Little in the building as well. Remember, this is the part of the conversation where you throw questions at them. If there is any of any kind, feel free to reach out. The number to call is 07 1051 If you want to send a text, feel free 909 Young Alpha, yeah? So tell me, so lady, what does it mean? Um, so lady means light, goddess of light. Hmm. Yeah, just just that's just it. And uh, it's it's not a it's not it's from Indian. I got the name from an Indian uh, culture. So it's a it's a goddess of light and easy woods. Okay, yeah. quite uh quite crisp. I think I think I like that. So goddess of light, uh, it's it's an Indian word. Yeah. Okay, that's beautiful. And how did you? Was it all you? The inspiration from that was it all you kevin little how, how did you feel when you heard that um yeah i thought it was pretty cool it's pretty interesting you know um it shows that he does his research you know he doesn't just do things for the sake of doing things um you know he he went and he looked for a name that had some sort of meaning and created a song around a song around it so that that really impressed me first of all and then um the production the whole feel of the record itself was really really nice i actually thought he sent the whole record to me i was kind of disappointed <laughs> that he had other people on it but <laughs> what you gotta do <laughs> Yeah. Okay, no, <laughs> not bad, not bad. Honestly, I, re- I, I, re- I really do like your energy together. I mean, have you guys ever thought about having a joint effort, like a full EP, or maybe album as the case might be, the <laughs> both of you together? You, you, hit the, you hit the nail on the head. Uh, exactly. Yeah, that's what we're doing. The, okay, for now, we, um, I'm, I'm working on this EP. No, should yeah. I call it an album? Because I think it's more than an EP. Okay. You know, he has 10 songs already. Um, mm-hmm. Some of this track, we have Inyang on board, we have Ice Prince, and uh, we have, mm, I don't like calling his name on the track yet, because I don't want to be, I don't want to get people too excited, because when you hear, imagine you hearing Kevin Little and Two Faced Divya, how mm. would you feel? I mean, that is greatness. Yeah, exactly. You see what I'm saying? I don't like <laughs> saying it, because, but it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. So, yeah. um, 10 tracks for Kevin, and I have six, um, six tracks at my EP. And we're working together. So after this one, we can do a joint. We can do a joint album together. Like we're just working with family now, you know. Yeah. We, we travel together. We do things together. So uh, Matt, Matt, yeah, Matt, you know, <laughs> that crazy. is actually beautiful. Honestly, let's uh, let's hear from our listeners for a minute. Okay, do me well to call back. Remember the number to call is zero seven zero zero one zero five one one zero five. I've got Young Alpha in the building. I've got Kevin Little as well in the building. I mean, we're talking about great musicians here. I mean, it's not every day you have people come together to make music. I will tell you guys this for free. So a couple of months ago, right? I was I was in this space with my friends, okay. right? And we and they were making music at the time. And, you know, based on my job, I was like, ah, oh, come on, uh, there's no big deal. I'm getting yeah. space. <laughs> and I was in the pool for a minute. And I tried to make a record. I was like, yo, uh, if I've ever insulted any artist before, bro, I will yeah. stop. It's <laughs> not because easy, bro. It is not easy. No. It's not easy. I, could not, I, could, I couldn't do anything. You know, <laughs> you, yeah, I mean, a lot of people think it's easy to, to be an artist, be a singer professionally. Uh, because when you go to the bathroom and you you know when you when you're having your shower <laughs> everybody can sing in the bathroom <laughs> <laughs> and you think oh this is easy when you go to the booth and you see it's not it's very difficult yeah. you do a first line to tell you no 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 you're sounding a little bit off key can you take it back again mm. you you keep going even the melody to get the melody you can get the melody but look for the words mm. like it's a whole different thing it's a whole different thing it's not easy man i know i know it is not it is definitely not easy how you doing Hello. okay good afternoon what is your name Okay, we might have to take, uh, you know, take a pause in that for a minute. I think the network is not entirely the best at the moment. So, so far, so good, Young Alpha. What yes. would you, are, are you based in the country? Let me start with that. Yeah, yeah, I'm based in the country for now. Okay, that's good. So, if you would say there's been any setback in the music industry, what would you say that is? Hmm. I would, I would say, um, we don't have much support from the government. Hmm. And I, in terms of, um, um, songwriting and production. I think uh, we don't have a we don't have a solid structure hmm. in the in, in the country in Nigeria right now mm. because you see some of recently things have been working. But you see when you write songs, you produce songs for these artists, you don't get credit. You, you don't that get, is yeah, real. Yeah, you don't get credit, and mm. you you just making all these artists. You're making these artists, and the 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 soul, the people behind making the artists are not recognized. And I think for me, I think that's a setback, and that's the reason why I'm out because I'm tired of all that. 
You're right, honestly. Uh, I've had a lot of people on the show complain almost about the same thing. You know, they tell you that, look, there is no proper structure to reward people exactly. that actually work behind the scenes. Exactly. I mean, there are so many people that make one song a hit record. Yeah. And that is real. So, Kevin, globally, yeah. what would you say has been the major setback in the music industry globally for you? Um, uh, for me, I don't I don't think there, there's a, a, a setback in the music industry. I think that the music industry has moved forward greatly. Um, I think in different cultures, there's challenges like what Young Alpha pointed out. Um, here in Nigeria and in the Caribbean, you have we have the same challenges. Wherever there's minority people, black people, our culture, there are this, these same challenges where our governments, they don't believe in the entertainment industry in that way. Um, and it, it, it's kind of a, a thing that we have in our culture where everybody wants to be the boss. Hmm. And musicians, musicians, because of the fame, they don't need money to be a boss. A musician could just be famous <laughs> and walk in a room. And um, hence, you know, people who are in hierarchy in positions that deal with, um, how should I say, academia. Hmm. They're, in, they're doctors, they're lawyers, they're politicians and stuff. There, there's that little bit of jealousy there mm. and that jealousy prevents them to a certain extent to look towards how they can help that industry and that's just one part of the problem you know it goes back as to where well, our countries are developing and there's other challenges that are also more priority as well mm. but everything can be fixed once you can find a way for everybody to make money I think that um, if the artists of these countries, including the Caribbean and places like Nigeria, Ghana, you know, the whole of Africa, come together and form an artist association and really start lobbying the government and having professionals amongst them that could help them with um, setting up proper um, accounting and showing how the government can really um, earn revenue from these things and helping to put things in place so that it's not just oh, you're paying the artist money, but there's taxes being collected from everything and every single aspect, whether it be the radio stations paying their taxes because that is how the artist gets paid. Yeah. The radio stations pay their taxes to the government for the mm. use of the artist material and then the government association pays out the percentage to the, to the, to the artist. artist and yeah. Back in return. Uh, yes. Yeah, so that is beautiful. Yeah, because I mean, all these entities are earning money and that's how artists earn money because you earn money the, the for playing music and and running these type of things people want to spend money to be heard amongst it and then some of that money goes back to the artist yeah mm. that is that is wonderful honestly eventually you you realize it's all a system yeah it's all a system and when the system is probably not functional yeah then we start having a couple of stories to tell exactly i mean it it, it, it is just crazy okay so uh well we get to wrap it up in the next few minutes but a lot of people will be mad at me if I don't get to ask you guys this. Okay. Give us exclusives as to what's to come. What nobody has ever heard before. Now, this will go individually, <laughs> okay? okay? Young Alpha, you go first. Kevin Little, you go next. An exclusive right here on the show. Okay. So you guys want me to sing? Or you want me to give you details of what I'm dropping? It could be both. <laughs> okay, 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 fine. You have uh, Suledi. Suledi's out already. And uh, we're shooting the video tomorrow. Okay. So Ice Prince, Kevin Litsu, and me will be shooting the video tomorrow. And um, I have my EP coming out at the end of this month, featuring great artists from outside Nigeria. Okay. So that's that's a lot for me, and that's a big record. That's a big project, you know. I'm, and I'm happy to say that I'm done with the whole thing because it's not easy, man. It it's is not, not easy. So I mean. I have, I have a lot of I have a lot of things coming out. I can't really you know sp say it right now. It's just too many. Too yeah, many. Yeah, too many. Yeah. Okay, no problem. So Kevin, you're next. Mm -hmm. Exclusive. Let's go. Exclusive. <laughs> um, well, you know, well, like, like Alpha said, so we're shooting a video tomorrow. I have a lot of songs with him um, that we're working on at the moment and finishing up. Um, there's a particular record called um, Afro Soca. Um, goes a little like um, 
Wine, wine, wine your waist to soca music. Just wine, wine, push it back to Afro soca. Go wine, wine, and you're feeling the vibe. So now we're gonna get wine. It's kind of like a like a that uh, is beautiful. Uh, actually, a uh, um, a dedication to Michael Jackson. As oh wow! Well, because it uses his melodies and stuff. Are you in serious the, in though? Music, yeah. That is yeah. beautiful. So you know we 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 have a lot of little surprises in there um and there's there's quite a few other records which i won't devolve i just give you a little taste of <laughs> yeah, i mean you've, i mean on, you've you done well I mean? <laughs> exactly. you have done well honestly and uh shout out to you young alpha young alpha for coming through honestly Thank it's you so much it's not every day we have you in the building and uh kevin little as well i just really hope you enjoy the rest of your stay here in nigeria but if there's yeah, anything you're looking forward to here in the country kevin what would it be oh man yo um it's just it's just the, the 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 parties the nightlife hanging with the, the people the love that i'm getting i i so look forward to it every day because when i come out from the hotel and i move around and the way the people treat me is so so incredible i love it here you know um to be to be known in the world when you are um a a, a, a black person and in your places where you're from this is the the motherland you know it feels good when i come here and i hear all the people saying kevin little kevin little like they, they're calling for me they're calling me a legend they love my music and stuff you know and um they they love what i represent so you know i look forward to waking up every day here while i'm here and just <laughs> vibing with the people man <laughs> that's yeah. the energy that is the energy you guys thanks for coming through young alpha thank you thanks so thanks for much. coming to kevin little yeah, but man. one final question i saw this article i don't know if it's true but i think it's fair just confirm there's this part of the article on on on, on the internet where it says kevin used to uh, work as a custom officer is that true oh yeah yeah it is um i actually when i when i was in school i i started singing when i was very young um i when i got into high school i i formed a a, a, a singing group with my friends and then after that i got into bands and then i went to college for two years i did an associate's degree in um electronic engineering wow and um, when i came out i was still always about my music and entertainment i was in a dance group as well which gave me more exposure to perform on stage and stuff like that i even did drama and um when i got out from college i worked some odd jobs i was a handyman here and there trying to do little things and then finally my mom found the contact and got me a job at the customs and excise department in st vincent mm. and i worked there for two years two years and that's <laughs> that's the salary that actually paid for me to to produce turn me on oh yeah, now i get you know? it yeah so now i get it I let's get this show on the road it's the rundown city 1051 fm